I'm going to uh, do a test that I've been wanting to do now for a long time. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour some ionized water into this ice cube tray. And oh, well, first I'm going to test it to see what alkaline uh, level it is. And then I'm going to pour it in the ice cube tray and I'm going to freeze it and then I guess melt it and then retest it to see what does the freezing process do to the ionized water. So um, let's start by just getting our machine. I'm going to use the... T All right, so um, I've got level three now going of the tie-in. I'm going to use this one for our test. And I'm going to, I suppose, slow down the flow just a tad. And I'm going to pour water in this cup. And uh, test it. All right, so it's it's looking like it's at about um, 11.22 alkaline. All right, so this is pretty high alkaline for level three, actually. And um, let me just double check, because I usually check the ORP on these things, too. Just I like I like to see what the RP is. Wow, and I wasn't even using the turbo, and it's a negative 853 RP. <laughs> Holy smokes! This is a a really nice um, ionized water, 11.25. Okay, so I'm going to that's what we're starting out with, and um, I'm going to go ahead and I guess turn this off. Put that away. Fill up the ice cube tray, and uh, I I'll um, free. What I'll do is I'll freeze it, and uh, then I will con conclude this video later on when I unfreeze it.